What is going on everybody? It is Lost in Place and I'm bringing to you a gameplay commentary where we are going to be talking specifically about Call of Duty. Well that's no big surprise, I do prefer Call of Duty videos on my channel so we are going into a little bit of a more specific topic and that is going to be the companies that design and make the Call of Duty titles and who we prefer. Quite simply, it alternates yearly. If you didn't already know this, I will be surprised, but just in case, it alternates years. Each year, uh, Infinity Ward makes a version, and then the next year it's Treyarch, then Infinity Ward, then Treyarch, and it alternates, and while the games are very similar in a lot of ways, they are very different in a lot of ways, and it got me to thinking, who do I prefer of those guys? Who do I prefer? Well, I'm going to mention who I prefer at the end. And what I did was I tweeted out to you guys, I asked you, quite simply, who you preferred, Infinity War or Treyarch, and why. And I wanted you to reply, and I'm going to be sharing with you some of the tweets that I got. And this is an ongoing kind of tally. I'm going to be checking back on this video later or on. I may even do a follow-up video if you guys want me to. And I want to see what you guys in the comment sections think, who you prefer and why. So go ahead and leave a comment about that. But let me just share with you some of the tweets I received. Some very interesting stuff. i got to say, I'm really... um. Surprised by some of the input I got. So first off, I'm nine says that he 100% agrees that Treyarch has some great ideas, but they have horrible execution. I wonder what he was referring to there. Possibly the pick ten, very ambitious way of going about the class setup. I'm personally not a huge fan of it, but it it, it is a great idea. Not necessarily sure it was executed properly. Uh, Tyler De Curls. He w replied saying he only likes Treyarch because of zombies. You're going to see that's a common theme in a lot of the tweets I receive. And uh, Mr. Jimmy Penguin said that he agrees 100%, but talking about Infinity Ward is a better caring company than <laughs> Shitark. I assume you mean Treyarch. Yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, Crisscross. Crisscross. Now, this is a sarcastic tweet. Took me a minute to figure that out, but he's basically saying that Black Op 1 trumps all other CODs in balance, and basically uh, gun balance, kill streak balance, all that stuff. I replied saying, oh yeah, how about the FAMAS? And he then said the FAMAS was just as good as the AUG. People just don't use the AUG as much, and the only nerf that game needed was for second chance. So clearly, he is supporting Treyarch here over Infinity Ward. He also said that Infinity Ward does have superior servers and better hit detection, but that's about it. Balance is greater than bullshit. Um, I'm not going to get too much into this, but I do think hit detection and good servers is a very good quality to have. Weapon balance is as well, though. So, you know, we're, we're going to chalk this one up for Treyarch. Uh, Mickey CTX, he's, he says, basically, to be honest, his last fun Call of Duty to him was Modern Warfare 2. The rest he plays just because it's customary. Uh, Freak Otami, he says he enjoys Infinity Games War, Infinity Ward's games more, uh, the movement, and etc. But he likes Treyarch as a company more, as they support esports and the community. So that will be another neutral vote. But good points you bring up. That uh, There are some truths to what you're saying there. Susan says, whichever one will make my controller vibrate more hmm okay then <laughs> Susan I love you girl uh, a Dextro says Treyarch don't get me wrong this is a very close one Infinity Ward is awesome but zombies takes the win I ran out of room yes yeah, so again another vote for zombies you know if you're a strict multiplayer like myself and don't play with zombies that kinda takes away the, a lot of the luster from the Treyarch games Darkstar he says he prefers Treyarch games more he likes the dark art style the zombies and a slightly more difficult hit detection uh, there is definitely a big difference in art style between the games. I will agree with that. D. Gibson says Infinity Ward, COD 4, was the best one. And in better multiplayer maps, and they kept it basic. They didn't try going too far over the top. Uh, from what I've heard about Ghost, the, the rumors, that is pretty over the top. So, you know, we'll have to wait and see. But Black Ops 2 definitely set a lot of new trends. And do you think it was too far over the top? I don't know. All right, Bush Wookie. In his opinion, Treyarch games are too cartoony, and Infinity War games look more realistic and have better controls and gameplay. Alright, thank you, Bish Wookie. Got Antics, he's going with Treyarch, and the only reason he likes Infinity War games at all are the special kill streaks, the nuke and the mobs. That's a very good point. They, that is an Infinity War sp specific trait there. Treyarch changes up their games more, though. Hmm, okay, good points, good points. CWFCNV, um, uh, so whatever. J. Triarch have taken steps backwards, making core playlists unbearable with bullshit OP snipers, and that they're hoping to force you to league play. I don't necessarily think the OP snipers and shotgunners are to, made to force you into league play, but 
you know, that is a decent point you bring up. You know, they are fairly uh, powerful, yeah. All right, Joey Alvey Jr. says, he likes both for competitive, but Infinity Ward has me hooked since COD 4. Again, COD 4 being mentioned, due to the maps and guns and the lag compensation. All right, uh, there were a lot of issues with lag compensation in Infinity War, uh, in uh, Modern Warfare 3, so, yeah, we'll, we'll move on. OBG, OBJ every day says Triarch because Infinity Ward rewards bad players with death streaks, support streaks, one shot kill weapons are too easy to use. Very good point about the death streaks and support streaks. Although Triarch also has a share of one shot kill weapons that are pretty easy to use. Chips at Chihoy. <laughs> Triarch because he doesn't get bullshitted as much as I would on Infinity Ward's game. Very vague, but I guess you're entitled to your opinion. One plus two. He says, Triarch because they treat the community better and they have a lot of Easter eggs and zombies. That is true, but again, we're coming back to the zombies. You know, if you're not a fan of zombies, that is a, a serious detriment right there. Gators NC. He likes Triarch's games because... He likes Triarch's games better because each game has been entirely different. On Finley Ward uses similar textures and styles in their games. You know, I am going to have to kind of agree with that. You know, if I picture in my head a Modern Warfare 3 and then a Modern Warfare 2 map, there's a lot of similarities in the colors and the designs. So, yeah, but if you picture Black Ops versus Black Ops 2, huge difference. All right, we've got 4G Gaming. He's going to have to side with Infinity Ward just because their games are usually smoother and they lag a little bit less. Yeah, I don't play Modern Warfare. His follow-up tweet said it very much. So, okay, good point. Uh, Master Wanky. Who let the dogs out? Woof, woof, woof. The Panda Waffle. He says Infinity Ward because they at least give a shit and update their problems. Infinity Ward is actually very good with communicating with the community and patching. Uh, Treyarch's not too bad either, but I feel that Infinity Ward has a little bit more communication on Twitter with its community. Miss Runs and Guns says Infinity Ward enough because I'm a girl gamer. Wow. No, that's that's a joke one. Here's a legit one. Infinity War, because the feel of the game always feels smoother, and I rate... What the f... Okay, moving on. Homie Red MUFC. Infinity Wars for me lost in place due to the fact I still class Call of Duty 4 as the best one I have ever played, single player or multiplayer. I am going to have to agree with you there. My favorite Call of Duty probably would be COD 4. Probably. That's a hard call to make, but it is definitely one of my favorites. KC says, Infinity Ward, he likes the weapons more. Um, short to the point, and that is a good point. You prefer their weapons more. Okay. Adextro says, Infinity Ward lost its fire with Modern Warfare 3. That's what I was going to say. Um, yeah, so Modern Warfare 3 ruined it for you. I wonder what you think about um, Modern Warfare 2 and the first Modern Warfare, you know, if, if that. But, okay. Ernest says, Infinity War games seem to be more fast-paced and you can be more stealthy. I would rather one strong host and everyone three-bar. A uh, host always does seem to be an issue in a lot of these games, in both Infinity War and Triarch, but he feels that it's a lot more of an issue with Triarch than Infinity War. All right, vote goes for Infinity War. Uh, mistakes were made. Triarch, because of how noobish you can be in their games and piss people off. So he's saying it's easier to troll in Triarch games. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's legit. Uh, Monday Gaming says Infinity War because they have an open enforcement team so the average player can effectively report cheaters. That is right. They do have a Twitter account that all you have to do is tweet a picture or a video of someone boosting and they will get reset. On the other hand, Treyarch is a lot more reliant on their in-game reporting system and no ability to report anyone via Twitter. Uh, Wicked Trapnel says Infinity War is more for the general public and Treyarch is more for the competitive gamer. He enjoys both aspects, but had the most fun in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, very good points about the uh, public for Infinity Ward and the competitive gamer for Treyarch. I definitely agree with that. But the vote's going for Infinity Ward, because that's the... Yeah, that's what he said. Miss Instincts, she says, that's because Modern Warfare 2 is the best COD of all time. Well, it's a toss-up. COD 4 was awesome, too. Both Infinity Ward games, so we're giving that one to Infinity Ward. Uh, J. Huff, Treyarch maps are so much better than Infinity Ward, plus zombies. So zombies pulling weight for Treyarch. WizHD says, Treyarch, because there's rarely any BS in the game, unlike Infinity Ward, that rarely fixes anything, but both has flaws. Uh, absolutely, they both do have flaws. It's going to be really a miracle to ever get a Call of Duty that's perfect. Um, but he th says he feels that Treyarch fixes their flaws quicker. Uh, Lon T says, Infinity Ward, they lead the way with COD 4. 
And they really made the first person shooter genre game change. And they really did. They definitely did. I cannot, dis I cannot disagree with that. Uh, Vigor says, if he had to choose, I would choose Infinity Ward. I don't know why, but Treyarch guns sound like toys versus Infinity Ward's guns that kill. So the gun sounds make a difference for you. All right, very interesting. Uh, these are our final tweets, and I left these two for final because I happen to agree with them thoroughly. And yes, my opinion will side with these. Infinity Ward is my personal preference. And because they actually listen to the community and roll out updates as soon as they start getting complaints about the game, Infinity Ward is fantastic with dealing with community feedback and adjusting the game accordingly. And Sked, or uh, Elliot Sked, <laughs> yeah, that's the comment right there. Just remake COD 4, bro, just do it. That's all we want. That's what I want. So there you have it, guys. Uh, that is the voice of my Twitter followers. I, now I would love to hear the voice of my YouTube subscribers. So guys, comment below. Let me know what you think. Um, I haven't kept count while I've been doing this commentary, so I will on the screen. You'll see the vote as of right now. And I'm curious. Let's keep it going, guys. Comment below. Let me know what you think. Until then, I am lost in place and I'm out of here.